Going back to racenews.com, I'm Magic in a field of seven fillies and mares, three and up will travel a mile and 16th in Friday's eighth and featured race at Oaklawn Park for non winners of two other than or optional claimers of 62 5 tag. And with me to preview the race is Aaron Halterman. Aaron, the two to one favorite is number seven coach for Brad Cox. This is her first time facing older horses, plus we haven't seen her since April when she was ninth in the Kentucky Oaks. Did you pick Coach on top, or are there too many red flags here to take her at what's going to be a short price? I really don't think there's a lot of red flags. Uh, you know, haven't been seen in, in a long time, but Brad Cox usually does pretty well off of, off of that kind of thing, so I'm not really worried about that. Uh, the horse has some class. You know, that being said, I think two to one was the problem. I, I didn't want to swallow that two to one price. So I went to the number four Jilted Bride uh, for my top choice here. Uh, a horse to two back, ran pretty well at Churchill Downs, got second against similar company. And then last time out in a grade three race there at Belmont was third. Um, you know, I think this horse third to third, uh, start off the, the layoff there. I think this horse is ready to run her best race. So I'm a Jilted Bride on top. So you're going to take a shot against the uh, the two to one favorite. Probably going to be a much shorter price than that uh, come post time. If you wanted a longer shot horse to maybe spice up the exotics, where are you looking? Yeah, I mean you've got some options in here. I thought the horse on the rail, Ara, made a lot of sense. Uh, Florent Giroux jumping on this horse, getting back to the dirt. Uh, I think this horse has the most speed in the race and speed on the rail. I think it's going to be a good thing. So I think this horse will be the one they have to run down. Look for the six, maybe Hypernova to challenge. But overall, I think the one is going to be the one that gets out in front and tries to take this field a long way. Was Has been on the turf the last three races, now moves back to the dirt. I think uh, that's her best surface. You can always trust Steve Asmussen to show up with a big effort at Oaklawn Park. Head over to racenews.com for free picks for every race, every track around the country, including Oaklawn Park. If you want the Oaklawn Park free featured race previews each day that they are running this meet, Go to youtube.com slash racing dudes. Hit like if you like this video. Hit subscribe if you really like it. Tell all your friends, and we'll see you at the track.